Howdy, howdy, howdy. You got gourd, you're hurting hippie. You recognize the street, I hope, by now, because it's almost always where these Riverside Rambles end up. What's going on with Gordy today? Well, I'll tell you, folks. Thanks for asking. I'm in pain. I, the same kind of pain I had Monday, but not as hard, came at me about 2 in the morning, and it's noon now, and... I just felt it really, I needed to get fresh air, especially, look around here. You can see wet roads and sunny skies. It's seven degrees. When I woke up, it was seven degrees. In a couple hours, it'll be, um, let's see, seven degrees. <laughs> and seven's a great number. So I thought I'd come out here, walk in this Everything's wet and the snow's squishy instead of crunchy and I just love that kind of stuff Even though I'm feeling really I'm having a hard one What I did though, I put a transdermal patch a CBD patch on my back only about half an hour ago I Didn't know if that would help the way I want it to and that's to help with the it's it's my bowels and my in, my digestion system <laughs> uh, but it's also hurting my lower back so i put it on my back and wow i am feeling a fair amount better i know i'm going to need a lot of rest tonight but i also knew that i needed to get out i needed to get out i thought i was going to be right at this time what a beautiful sky that right at this time, I was going to be with my son. My nine-year-old uh, has a dentist appointment, getting maybe a tooth pulled, uh, just minor stuff, but he wanted me there. But then when they found out how sick I was last night, mom's a little concerned that maybe it's uh, contagious. So I'm not going. And, uh, and so, I still had to get out though. I still had to get out and get a feel for what what the day's like. Get get a little bit uh I think everything's going to be fine, but I needed to get this air just breathing and get these feelings out. So peace and cheers friends, love and harmony. There will be more. Sorry about that, friends. I had uh, I had a couple of messages come through from from my boy's mom as to uh, he, it turns out he has a cavity and they're going to fix that and they're going to pull one tooth and uh, so it isn't much, but I wanted to take a look at it and and when you get messages while well, you you got one train of thought, you totally lose it. Especially, I gotta say, the CBD patch I put on my back. I'll have to do a review of these things. This is the first time I've used it for indirect help. I've used it two times for major back pain. And I put it right where the pain was, once lower back, once middle back. And each time, it, it, it within the day, it lasts for 12 hours releasing CBD at a fairly steady rate and in each case by the end of the day I was better which is unusual for me in a bad back they're really unusual for me in a bad back so do I recommend them I I most certainly do but I need to learn them more and how to use them and when to use them as to how it's going to really, really work for me before I start recommending them. But wow, it, it has helped me. I'm walking an hour ago. There's no way I, I didn't even think I could walk down to his dentist appointment. So I was pretty glad when they said, no, don't, don't show up. We're okay. You might be contagious. We'll handle it. So I was glad for that. Uh, but now, I could walk there if I needed to. If they called me and said, hey, come on down, I'd be there. So that's that patch doing what it needs to do. 
Well, lots of people around. Peace and cheers, friends. I may be back. This might be, in, be the end of it. I'm getting close to going home. Uh, really, really nice walk. Stopped in at the Delicatessen, but my stomach's bothering me too much. I didn't want to try new food. It's a Mid-Eastern deli, so there's baklava and flares and all that kind of stuff. So I'm going to be back there, not today. And I did want to say, you know, I said 2018, 2017 was uh, attack my finances and I I did that and some. So 2018 was attack my health. Get a get at least better. So um so I want to tell you I'm not letting this latest bout. Monday was horrible. Last night was bad, not horrible. I'm not letting this hurt me. I uh, I, sorry, just messages about my son and they're filling the cavity now. Uh, I already contacted my doctor and on Monday I'll be making an appointment and I'm going to find out, is this, I can't just continually think, oh, this is fibro, another fibro, another fibro. Maybe he needs to take a look. So I am following through and I'm being real careful on this walk, folks. I'm taking it easy. Peace and cheers, friends. Love and harmony. And hey, see someone without a smile today? Give them this, give them yours. Make them smile. It's worth it. Peace, friends.